Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Sorry for the shakiness here. We're, yeah. We're skipping a tripod here and we're gonna go hands-free. It's been a while since I filmed a grocery haul and I figured why not because I just went to the commissary. All right, let's see what I bought. Okay, so starting off, it wasn't that much, but I got a pork tenderloin. This was, of course, I'll include the prices, but it had some little caca on it. Uh, for those of you guys that don't speak Spanish, there was just some stuff on the outside and I was not feeling touching it. So we got one of those, but a pork tenderloin comes with two pieces, but that's besides the point. Anyway, and I picked up a block of some medium cheddar for some mac and cheese picked up three of my favorite coffee creamers. I wish they sold these at Sam's Club with like the big bottle. Literally, it's like three of these combined for half the price of this. But thankfully, my commissary has a great price on coffee creamer. And I picked up some mozzarella cheese for some, what am I making? Birria tacos. And I, I couldn't find Oaxaca cheese. And if I can't find Oaxaca cheese, y'all ain't gonna find it either, so. Just got some mozzarella because it works and some grapes. I touched them and I hope that they're firm because I like super crisp, firm grapes, but besides the point, also got some ground beef. Look at this price. So this was previously frozen or I guess it's currently frozen. Anyway, ground beef, it was $1.58. Originally it was $2, but $1.58 for a little over a pound. That's like ridiculous. I'm telling you guys, if you guys watch my how to save money in the grocery store, this is what I meant by reduced meat, clearance meat, discount meat. This was it. Originally two, now 158. Look at this. And a dollar sixty-one and a dollar sixty-one. This is amazing. And then I got two cans of whole peeled tomatoes. I wanna say that I had, you know what? Yeah, okay. So I got this pasta sauce and the first ingredient of this is whole peeled tomatoes. And I'm like, something about this tomato sauce tastes different. I couldn't figure out what it was, but also while I'm here, I got one of these. Um, I don't buy jarred tomato sauce or not tomato sauce, but pasta sauce very often because I just love to make my own and it's also a lot cheaper, but this is a good alternative and I needed it for a recipe. So that's perfect. But that brings me back to the reason why I bought whole peeled tomatoes because I wanna to try to make my own sauce with these and see if it tastes different than crushed tomatoes. Anyway, and then I got this milk. I could have swore I put two of them in my cart. Now I'm gonna to have to check my receipt and see if I left it maybe in the car. I should go check on that. And then I got a pound of carrots. This was 99 cents, guys. Do not buy a little itty bitty carrots for the same price when you only get eight ounces instead of 16. So got one of those. And for my birria tacos, I needed corn tortillas. I am not the biggest fan of corn, but my friend who is Mexican was like, you have to do corn. If, it, if not, it's not authentic. So we're gonna try those. And then I got some ground turkey. I like to buy mine in the tube like this because it was cheaper. I think it was cheaper by like, 45 cents, but you know what? That's 45 cents you're saving and they have these same exact ingredients. So don't ask me what the difference is because I have no clue. And a zucchini because health, you know? And some cauliflower that I needed for some Italian wedding soup I'm gonna try to make that a friend gave me a recipe for. And also cilantro because it's not a grocery haul of mine if there is no cilantro. And some celery. This I think also was 99 cents. This is great, a big old thing of celery and you can freeze it. So it's probably what I'm gonna do because I don't use celery very often. And some lentils for a lentil soup I'm gonna try to make. I didn't used to be the biggest fan of lentils, but then when I cook them very, very well, almost overcooked, they are perfect. They almost taste like a bean. Are, I, I'm assuming these are beans? Yeah, we're just gonna call it a bean. And the meat for my bedia. I was looking at so many different types of meat you could use for BDA, and this was just coming out the cheapest. So I'm not trying to make, you know, no $30 BDA. And a red pepper. This was a good price too, and it's humongous. And I want to say that that was all of it. Can anybody guess my total? Anybody? I believe I will have my total right here, but I believe it was $55.77. No, 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 $50. And 75 cents.
77 cents i don't know but that is all for my grocery haul do not forget to thumbs up this video which is also called a like so give this video a like make sure you're subscribed and catch me in my next video i knew that i got a second milk I'm so glad that I was filming this video because I would have left this in the trunk. It was so deep in there. But, all right, now that is finally everything from the commentary.